Billy was just a peanut butter jar. He lived with the other spreads in my cupboard, waiting eagerly each day to see if he'd be eaten. For weeks, that was Billy's purpose in life, to be spread over a piece of bread, celery or apple. But one Saturday morning, he saw her. And that is when everything changed. He had no idea who she was or even what she was. All Billy knew is that he wanted to meet her and spend time with the beautiful red spread. After being put away that afternoon, Billy decided to ask Steve, the old Marmite jar, how he could meet up with that gorgeous spread. And that's where you're wrong, mister, yelled Steve. She's not a spread, and she never will be. She's a jam, and our kind do not mix with jams, no matter the circumstance. They think they're better than us. They think we're nothing, just because they get a fridge. Oh my God. With that, Billy tried to forget about her and focus on getting picked for breakfast duties. But preening himself for breakfast just didn't matter to Billy the way it once had. No matter how hard he tried, he couldn't stop seeing that jam jar. So one night, as everyone else slept, Billy crept from the cupboard and made his way to the fridge. Unbeknownst to Billy, Sonia, the strawberry jam, had been just dreaming about a certain peanut butter jar. So it was almost too much for her young heart when that same peanut butter jar knocked on her fridge in the middle of the night asking her to dance. Dancing under the light of a single candle, each of them knew they were made for each other. So just about every night after that, Billy and Sonia danced and talked and played and walked and enjoyed every moment of each other's company. That is, until their families found out. Both sides were furious, although Billy bore the brunt of it. Both he and Sonia had spread beaten out of them. Those who had called themselves Billy's friends and his mentors laid into him. Then, as the night drew to a close, they were taken away to their separate cupboards, never to see each other again. The next day, when I awoke, there was a mess right across the bench. Peanut butter and jam were splashed together. I got out the cloth and I began to clean. But halfway through, I made an accidental discovery. It was sweet. It was savoury. It was everything I'd ever been looking for. And it was everything Sonia and Billy had been looking for. Sometimes if you want something enough, the entire universe will work together to give it to you. That's what happened with these two young lovers. Billy was just a peanut butter jar. But he was a peanut butter jar in love. And that made all the difference. <laughs>